a funky looking 33, but this is number 33. Solve the proportion. 8 over z minus 2 is equal to z plus 2 over 4. So what we need to do again is use the cross product rule. Multiply 8 by 4 and then z minus 2 by z plus 2. So the way we're going to get our answer is cross multiply. We get 8 times 4 is equal to z minus 2 times z plus 2. From here, we need to uh, distribute or FOIL, whatever makes you feel comfortable, same thing. Z times Z gives you Z squared, and then Z times two would give you plus two Z, and then we have negative two times Z would give us, uh, what is that gonna give us, negative two Z. And then finally, we have negative 2 times negative 2 would give us negative 4. So we're in, we end up with 2, or z squared minus 4 equals 8, 16, 24, 32. From here, we are at 32 is equal to z squared minus 4. Inverse of minus 4 will be plus 4, plus 4. So we have 36 is equal to z squared. And to figure out our answer, we would just do the following. Square root both sides, square root both sides. You get plus or minus 6 equals z. So plus or minus could be the answer, but we need to check if our answer will be a real solution. So let's check our work. Okay, so we got z right here. We have z here and z here. So let's try the, the positive z first. Let's try the positive z first. So we're at 8 is over 6 minus 2 equals 6 plus 2 over 4. So what we have is 8 over 4 is equal to 8 over 4 works because then 4 goes into it, 1 half equals 1 half. But it's already simplified all the way. So now let's try the negative z. Let's see the negative z answer. So we're going to do the same thing again. 8 over negative 6 minus 2 equals negative 6 plus 2 all over 4. 8 over negative 6 minus 2 will give us 8 over negative, what is it going to give us, negative 8 equals negative 6 plus 2 would give us a negative 4 over 4. From here, 8, negative 8 goes into 8, negative 1 time, and then 4 goes into negative 4, negative 1 time. Therefore, our two solutions are plus and minus 6.